Hi, Mark here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to adjust the laser crosshairs on a Ryobi DP102L drill press. The first thing you want to do is to clamp a piece of scrap stock to your table, preferably one like this with a smooth surface so that the laser crosshairs will register clearly on it. Next, you want to install a 1 16th inch drill bit in the chuck because it's about the same width as a laser crosshair, allowing for very accurate alignment. Then you want to turn on your drill press and lower that bit into the wood just enough to mark the spot. Then you want to turn on the laser crosshairs to see how accurate it was. You can see here that the right laser crosshair goes directly across the hole so it's well set, but the left one is off and we're going to have to adjust it. We adjust it by inserting a 3 millimeter Allen wrench into the set screw loosening it up and then turning the laser to just exactly the right spot and tightening up the set screw. Being careful not to over tighten it so that the set screw would blow through the soft brass barrel of this laser and perhaps damaging the wires inside. Now we're set to drill just a couple of inches from the chuck very accurately. But we also have to check to see that the laser crosshairs are still aligned over the hole when the table is several inches from the chuck. We do that to make sure that the laser crosshairs are aligned properly vertically as well. And it's a good thing in this case that they are because there is no vertical alignment on this drill press. Perhaps on your drill press you have lasers that have a dual axis so that there's both a vertical and a horizontal adjustment. There you have it. I've showed you how to adjust the laser crosshairs on a Ryobi DP102L drill press.